seems to have helped him, but really, it's put him behind. The ace on the turn gives him an incredibly strong hand. In fact, it gives him the second best possible hand given the board. He is currently only losing to a player who holds exactly a 10 and a jack as his hole cards. Given the fact that he's beating every single possible combination of starting hands except one, he's going to bet or raise the turn. He was more worried about the flush draw than the straight draw on the flop because the number of starting hands containing two playable diamonds far outnumbers the number of starting hands containing exactly a jack and a 10. Does this mean that he shouldn't worry at all about the possible straight? No. My point is that he probably won't start to realistically assume that the jack and 10 are out there until he's already been raised or re-raised, and by then, the money will have already gone into the pot. That's just how it goes sometimes in poker. It's not often that two players hold starting cards that combine with the board to make the best and second best possible hands. But when it happens, the pots tend to be big, and the player with the second best hand tends to lose a lot of chips. The good news for the button is that his three aces can still improve on the river. There is no river card that can give the middle position